Oh no, Monk of the, the camera. <laughs> Live studio, Brian. Hi, how are you doing? My Twitch Prime broke. It's okay, Dave. It happens. But yeah, the game where. Oh, it's like not even capturing the game now. All right. I see how it is. Remove. I just didn't share it. Smile. Okay, there we go. I was like, hello? I am capturing. Anyways, today's game, guys, is called Coffee Talk. It just, it looks so cozy. So I decided that we were going to play it. I need to contact support apparently, but I haven't done so in a while, so I can't find it. Oh no, like the email? Um, Jester. Yeah, Twitch is really annoying about notifications. Sometimes it'll do it immediately, and other times it'll just tell you like after the stream's already over. So, um, if you're in the Discord server, you can, um, hmm. Do you have, yeah, there's like a stream notification tag that you can add to your uh, account. And basically it'll tell you, it'll ping you anytime I start streaming. Uh, MP3, thank you for the bits. Don't forget to cheer subway bits to add more bits to your total. Oh, that's right. That's happening too. I forgot. Okay we play what's your name barista nope moika ah okay it's moika yes yes a game by toget productions seattle 2020 oh no i should have saved this game for next year i messed up guys i messed up Take it back, shutting it down. A city filled with dreams and madness. Oh, this is so pretty. A time when the great war between races is but a footnote in history. Also, for like context, I have no idea what this game is about other than we go to a coffee shop and potentially serve people. Other than that, I have like no idea what it's really about. I tried, I'm trying to keep everything at like a minimal amount of information so that I can if there are good surprises I'm surprised if not then I can be honest and just be like this game was shit or it was great so we'll see yeah I love the, the art it's so pretty um random 15 months in a row thank you for the resub appreciate it a time when the great war between races is but a footnote in history. A time when anyone can dream of being whatever they want to be. Aww. And have those dreams crushed before they can even be discussed. Oh no -y. But still, it is a place and time where anything can happen. Whoa. It is when the elves have left the forest to build their startups. Whoa! It's not just humans. Okay. When the dwarves have emerged from their caves to start their automotive empires. When the orcs have put down their axes and started using computers to improve their lives. Whoa! Whoa! What happened to WoW? Everything's changed so much. Also, bye Chris. Thank you for stopping by. And when humans live among them, as driven as ever. It is the city that holds the many dreams and stories of its people. <sighs> okay. Most of these stories are left untold. But some few find solace in the embrace of bricks and wood and glass. Wow. Yeah, wow after the fall. <laughs> They're told over drinks, then take up residence in some stranger's memories. Man, 
I love I just love the art and atmosphere. Oh no, you're staying. Okay, my bad, Chris. In one cor corner of the city stands a coffee shop, a place that is only open when the sun is sleeping. Why not in the daytime too? A place where people share their stories. And these are the stories. All right, time to tell some stories. Coffee talk. <laughs> yeah, from Warcraft to Coffee Craft. Tuesday, September 22nd. Oh, I should have. I wish I had known this started on these dates. I would have totally waited two days. Or wait, no, today's the 18th. I could have waited a whole week. <laughs> well, oh, it's you. Hey, Moika, how's the night so far? It's calm, as usual. Got a slight problem, though. Huh? What happened? My supplier made some logistical errors. I don't have half of my ingredients today. Man, that's a bummer. Don't worry. I can still serve the caffeine you desperately need. That's good to hear. Anyway, let me set things up first. You're our first customer after all. Don't worry, take your time. I'm a writer, not an editor. <laughs> what the heck? So I'm used to taking things slow. Huh, <laughs> writer's blog again? Got that right. What are you writing now? Do you remember my plan to... Oh, one sec. I gotta go clean that machine. Uh, pardon the interruption. The machine is ready. You want your triple shot espresso now? Yes, please. And if you forget how to make it, just check your phone, okay? Anyway, I really need that triple shot espresso. Alright, alright, I get it. Triple shot espresso. Alright, check our phone. Shuffled. Tender hearted. Jeremy Gendru. Oh, that's that's like so neat. Also, hi, Mafei. Okay. Tomo da chill. No, this game. Oh, my thing's like covering some of the things. Don't worry, I'll read it out. Wow, Tomodachi. Freya, storyteller. Birthday, 29 January. Reiner for the Evening Whisper talks about mundane things, art, and life in general. Friends only. Close friends only. Alright, alright, alright. Georgie. Birthday, June 1st. Only friends, close friends only. Gala. Whoa, Gala. Uh, oh, he has a cat. He's with cats. Okay, September 13th. Friends only, close friends. What's he do? Everybody else has titles. Brew pad. Okay. Espresso. Blacker than a moonless night, hotter, and more bitter than hell itself. Oh, wow, there's a lot of drinks that are like still hot. Okay. Alright, so base. Coffee. Brew. <laughs> Am I doing it right? This is like like Valhalla. Slightly different like interface. Serve that bad boy. One cup of triple shot espresso. Special for oh my only customer tonight. Hmm, that aroma. Sip sip. Ah, exactly what I need. Anyway, where were we? Your plan to do something? Oh, Bab Fam Raid! Thank you, Bab Brewster. Appreciate the raid. Oh, that emote's so cute! <laughs> Thank you. Uh, yes, that. It's not that I hate writing stories for the newspaper, you know, but it seems like the right time for something bigger. So, a novel? Yes. It sounds so simple when I, I was making a plan. At least you still have your job. In case things go awry. <laughs> but, um, hi! Thank you for the, to your raiders. Hopefully you enjoy 
this chill stream. Oh, she's losing it. She's laughing. <laughs> uh, did I say something wrong? No, you were right. You said something I should have done. What are you talking about? You know, who owns the Evening Whisper? GRA Media, right? Yes. Uh, they are also the biggest book publisher in the country. So when an opportunity presented itself, I took it. What do you mean by opportunity? Well, I bumped into one of the big guys in the elevator. So naturally, I pitched my book idea. Uh-oh. Come on, don't look at me like that. Are you for real? Yeah, yeah, I know. It was such a stupid thing to do. So how did they react? Thankfully, he'd seen my short stories, so he challenged me. If I can get a draft ready in a month, he'll pull some strings and get the fiction publishing division to sign me up for a publishing deal. That sounds great. What are your What about your job at the Evening Whisper? You have time to do both? That's the hard part. I've been secretly working on the novel during office hours, and I'm falling behind on the newspaper's deadlines. If the chief finds out, she'll probably kick me out. Ooh, ouch. Well, at least you've got a month to finish the initial draft. That was last week. Babe, come on. <laughs> come on! Again, don't look at me like that. How far along are you? I assume the number of words you have written <laughs> is not too far from zero? Hey, that's rude. I've written some stuff, you know. Can I see it? Um, well... It was so bad that, well, after reading it... I just decided to delete everything immediately. So, zero. Ugh, <sighs> yes. I really need to finish it in, at most, two weeks. Then I'll use the extra week to polish and do some editing. Sounds like a plan. If you can pull it off. I know, I know, you don't need to be so cynical about it. That's why I'm here today. I'm hoping to find some inspiration. I wrote some of my best short stories here, you know. Really? Glad this place could be of service. Oh, it looks like someone's coming. I love, like, the background animations. I like her. She's cute. I mean, the, the, the other girl's cute too. But this one is a demon. Uh, I had rain going in the background of my stream, and now the tone of yours right now is perfect. Aw, oh, that Brewster. Appreciate that you can enjoy the stream. This character is very cute. I like their hair. Yeah. Oh, so it's ah, I love it. I love this art. Why? Yeah, wife them all. Welcome. Hi there. Hello. Good evening. Uh, for here, miss? Yes, please. I'm not really sure what to order though. What do you recommend? Oh, she's smoking. Oh noy. That depends highly on your mood. I'm just here to meet my boyfriend. Fuck, she has a boyfriend! Also, um, th so this is a demo. The full game isn't out yet, but you can, if you look up, uh, Coffee Talk game, um, you'll find the, I think it's on, it they're like developments all on itch.io. So I, th actually, I think they might have, um, I think they have a Steam page set up so that you can wishlist the game. Also, fuck, she has a girl for a boyfriend. Darn it. I'm just here to meet my boyfriend. Not planning to wake, not planning to be awake all night. So definitely no coffee. How about chocolate? It's perfect for this weather. That's a good idea, actually. Thank you. You're welcome. Anything with chocolate, please. I'm so sad. All right, fine, it, whatever, it happens. Sad boy hour. Chocolate, chocolate, chocolate. Okay, nitpick. This is chocolate, 
But this is cocoa powder. That's different from chocolate, so... Small nitpick. <laughs> Brew that bad boy up. Why is it bitter? Oh, well, cocoa. It's actual cocoa. It's not chocolate. Serve. One cup of chocolate ready. Thank you. So warm. Expecting it to be cold? <laughs> so you're waiting for your boyfriend? Yes, he should be here soon. Look at you now. You went from empty to three customers in one night. I thought this place would be more crowded, considering it's the only cafe that's still open after midnight around here. Because it's the only cafe that's still open past midnight, it's mostly empty. Now that you mention it, it is good for business having the cafe only open at night. Or is it good? Also, yeah! Bye bye, Bab Rooster! Things are stopping by. Uh, is it good for business having the coffee only or the cafe only open at midnight? Probably not. Yeah, definitively not. Yep, what she said. Then why? I just love doing it. And there's always someone lo longing for a warm drink at this hour. That's fascinating. Pardon me for asking. But how can you survive running the cafe like this? That's a secret. Are we a demon? Why I here is damn rich, that's the secret. Oh really? He's exaggerating. Don't worry about it, Moika can manage. I'm sure this cafe won't go bankrupt anytime soon. So, you'll still have <laughs> you'll have a weird calm place to meet up at night. That's good to hear. By the way, are you a regular here? I don't really have anywhere else to go. I'm a writer that works well at night and in a cafe. Not many options for that. Ah, no wonder. She's a pretty good writer, you know. You can find some of her stories in the Evening Whisper. Shut up. Wow, that's interesting. What kind of things do you cover? I cover the stories of people around town. Personal, interesting, weird stories. I also contribute to their short stories. I love their fiction. You wrote those stories? Thank you. I wrote most of them, but not all. That's so cool. Then, are you here to write a new piece? I should be. But I don't even know what to write about. <laughs> Welcome! Hi. Sorry to keep you waiting. No, it's a boyfriend! Fuck! They're so hot! It makes sense when they're together! <laughs> Sorry to keep you waiting. I'm just fucking crumbling. Also, now you know why I don't like streaming with a webcam on. Because I just... <laughs> oh, it's okay. <laughs> My brain! I, like, to 100% should have seen that shit coming. But I was just so like, oh my god, he's so pretty. Like, what the fuck? My brain just, like, short-circuited. Like, literally. cry <laughs> it's okay i had a nice chat with the fine folks here hi there hello hi would you like to order something oh yeah such an intense stare ah oh, i can't look at him hmm surprise me what kind of an order is that well i don't really know what to order do you have any preferences sir oh the zoom in oh no something better to keep me awake with milk. Oh, draw some latte art on the top. Brew pad. Save me. Cappuccino, I guess? That has, yeah. Coffee. Milk. Brew. Latte art. Oh, no. -y. Oh. Invert? Oh no! Oh we- oh! Okay, I was like, how do I- the poor milk thing doesn't work. 
Okay. <gasps> oh my god, it's it's literally when I had my Oh my god, it's ah, I know this feeling cuz when Riot got me that like frother, I okay, when I messed with it. Oh my goodness. Oh, it feels weird though. Oh no. Ugh. This game. I'm gonna be here forever. Big blob. know what this is. It's a little dude creeping, like, coming out of a cave. Found his way home. Here's your order. <laughs> is this what you call latte art? That's cute. Perfect. I tried my best, okay? Anyway, I was distracted by some work. Plus, there's the rain. It's okay, Baileys. I was having a nice chat with them. Oh yeah, I haven't properly introduced myself. I'm Baileys. Oh my, where are my manners? I haven't introduced myself either. My name is Lua. Hi, I'm Freya. Nice to meet both of you. I'm Moika. Hey, did you know Miss Freya here is a writer for the Evening Whisper? Oh really? I've done some work for them a few times. Oh, what kind of work? I'm a freelance designer and illustrator. Of course he would be. Of course he would be. I've done some caricatures and infographics for the paper. I assume you were in contact with Steve? Yup, he's a nice guy to work with. Oh, really? Monka, what's that about? No, he isn't. But I've dealt with worse clients. Way worse. Yeah, I'm glad he's in the design and visuals department. I wouldn't be able to stand working with him directly. <laughs> Come on. He's tough to deal with, but definitely not the worst. Oh, of course. There's always another layer of hell beneath even the deepest hell. How do you usually deal with bad customers here? Only bad customers this late at night are lost drunkards or criminals. That sounds really bad. Nah, they're easy to handle. Yeah, just call the cops on them, right? That's because you're good with your fist. Monka, no I'm not. Not as good as your coffee making skill though. Thank you, I'll take that as a compliment. You're welcome. Anyway, I really need to start writing. Whatever it is that I'm going to write. So I'll leave you two. In the hands of our friendly neighborhood barista. Where are you going to write? Oh, not far. Just over at the table in the corner. Next to the windows. That's my spot. Oh, okay. Have fun. <laughs> I'll try. Good luck. Thanks. Also, yeah, are these two, like, are they a couple? Because they're alcohol-based? Or, like, their names are based off of alcohol? Should we move to other seats, too? Nah, here is good. Okay then. So, how's your day? It was fine. Work was nothing special. I finished my proposal early so that I could get out of the office. Plus, my boss is in a really good mood all day. I thought your boss was always a happy-go-lucky person. Well, he is. But today he was happier than usual. I'm not sure what happened, but it was great seeing him so happy. What about you? Any problems with your latest client? Yeah, this one is- Oh, no we. Yeah, this one is a pain in the ass. You know these memes that depict terrible clients? Well, she fits all the bills. <laughs> oh, no we. I could go on forever complaining about her, but that will help me a bit. You should make a meme about her. And lose my current project for a minute of laughter? That might be worth it, actually. 
You should ask Moika here how to deal with annoying clients. Oh yeah? How do you usually deal with annoying customers? The ones you don't want your you don't want <laughs> your fists to take care of. I do have my own methods, but it wouldn't be wise to talk about customers to other customers. Now that's one good lesson to learn for the day. Someone okay, I was like, someone's phone? It's not mine, right? <laughs> Your parents? Yes. So, you've talked to them? I did. It didn't end well. Nope. What did they say? A lot. Uh oh. They won't give us a chance at all? Anyone but an elf. That's what they said. Oh no! Also, hi if you're just joining us. Hi, Muzzy. How about you? More or less the same. I got into a fight with my old man. That's why I'm staying at Farron's place now. He kicked you out? You don't have to do this, you know. They are your family. I can't stand even one more second being a part of them. I might not have a stable income, but I can manage. But still, you don't know what they said about you last night. I'm sorry. What did they say about me? Or about my race, I assume. Forget it. I want to know. Just the same old shit. Bumbling about how elves are holy creatures, about our immor- Im Oh no -y. About our immortality, about how- How even if I outlive you- What? Nothing. About how if you outlive me, no other elves would want to be with an elf. That's already been tainted by a lowly succubus. That's exactly what they said. So this is it then. The end of our relationship. Oh no! Girl, I'll be here for you. It, it doesn't have to be. You know our families will never agree. We can just continue like this. What do you mean? They don't need to know that we're still dating. We can just continue the way we've always been, without them knowing. And then what? Do you want to be in the kind of relationship for the rest of eternity? We're not like humans, you know. We can't just elope. Why not? Also, Sentinel, thank you for the sub. Appreciate it. 21 months. And you won't get permission because you're too old. Lua, I don't care about their permission. I'll be glad to sever my family ties if I have to. I can't let you do that. You'll lose your immortality. If I get to spend my life with you, I don't mind. I don't mind a bit. Aww. You're making this hard for both of us. Do you feel happy when you're with me? Of course I do. Then you don't need any more reasons. You know we're perfect for each other. You don't even need to look deep down. Trust me, we can do this together. <sighs> I can't think about this clearly right now. We'll talk later. Lua, wait. I'm sorry you had to listen to our problems. Yikes, it's okay. That's alright. This cafe has seen all sorts of stories. I do hope yours will have a happy ending. Huh, I hope so too. Oh no, don't look at me like that. Do you have any alcohol? Sadly, no. That's a bummer. Well, do you have anything that's warm and can calm me down? Do you like green tea lattes? Green tea lattes? I'll take one. Alright, alright, alright. Oh, I hope you two have a good relationship later on. like so chill. I love it. Mate art. Looks like a little 
salamander. Oh, this is like so weird to control all with like a mouse. second. Moika lying to herself. She wants that relationship to burn. Wow now. Whoa now. Dude, my signature dead squirrel. <laughs> Dude. Oh, the latte art in this. I'm so bad. Hold on. Let me draw the tree. Someone you love? I love this cafe. But I'm sure that's not the answer you're looking for. Huh. I didn't really have an, any expectations. Man, out of all the creatures in the world, why did I fall for her? You can't choose who you fall in love with. You can, if you try hard enough. At least, that's what my old man said. He really is one pretentious elf. Aww. But I guess all of them are. Entitled, pretentious, immortal douchebags. At least you have an eternity to learn and change. Or an eternity to be an eternal asshole. Anyway, I need to go now and probably drink myself under until the sunrise is. Oh, it's still a while until sunrise. More time for me to drink then. See you around. See you around too, Miss Freya. Thank you. Do visit again. She's so sad. Me, sad. Are you listening from the corner? Yes. Poor souls. I hope they find their way together soon. Me too. Anyway, I need to leave. I have to get up earlier than usual tomorrow. Okay. I think I'm gonna close the shop up after this. That's pretty early. I know. After the rest of the deliveries come in tomorrow, I'll open as usual. Okay. Have a good night then. You too. Italian delight. Wednesday. Zombie virus from Africa might have reached Seattle. Whoa. Seattle's grocery distribution problems harm local restaurants. Oof. Free up charge. Start the day. Good evening. Good gracious. What is wrong with you? Can you just enter like a normal customer? I'm sorry. But I'm so excited to share with you. What are you talking about? I knew I know what to write for my novel. Is it one of your impulsive temporary ideas again? Hey, don't be rude. I'm being serious here. Okay, okay, just tell me. What are you going to write about? This cafe. What? I'm gonna write stories about this cafe and the people who come here. Are you for real? Yes! What if I say you can't do that? I'm not asking permission. That's like a breach of the customer's personal lives, you know. Relax, I know that. I just need some inspiration from this place. The stories themselves will be loosely based on what I hear and see here. How loosely based? My Walker novel versus movie level loosely based. Manga, the old one? 
Of course I'm talking about the old one. Hmm. They're already very different, you know. You can't even get more different than that. Hmm. I mean, it's not like I can tell you not to write about a cafe, right? No, you can't. Although, you can just ban me from coming. Okay, you're banned. <laughs> what? Just kidding. I wouldn't do that to my loyal customer. Very funny. Thanks for not banning me, though. Anyway, I'm really excited to see who comes here tonight. I wonder what kind of stories they'll have. Balu, hi. Welcome, welcome. To be continued, no. No. I think that's it, that's it. Wishlist us. I'm sad. This game is like so chill. I'm so excited for when it comes out. Also, welcome back, MP3. Freya, yeah, Freya's really pretty. I, I like all the characters so far. Um, if you're just joining us, I just played the demo for a game called Coffee Talk. It's kind of like Valhalla, if you've played that. It takes place in like a little, little cafe, serve customers, hear their stories. Yeah. Man, yeah, I really enjoyed this one. I'm gonna wish list it right now. Um, there was another little I think tonight I I'm probably just gonna do like little short short games. Mm. Store page. I know um Chris linked it earlier, but here's if you're also interested in this game, feel free to follow the link I just posted in chat and add it to your wish list. Um, they're planning to release the full game January 2020. Wow, I'm so excited. I love indie games. They're so like, ah, so good. Also, Tough Tony, 13 months in a row. Thank you so much for the resub, appreciate it. No, it is not an ad. No ad. This was just a game I like. I don't even remember how I found it, but um, on occasion I will just download a bunch of like indie games for streams, and then sometimes I get to them, sometimes I don't. Um, I just love checking them out. So, <laughs> if anybody would like to sponsor me, I'm up for it. <laughs> 